over several years tried to lose weight different ways and it was getting to be a very serious problem. Couldn't sleep, high blood pressure. I had reached 426 pounds and it was time to do something. So I embarked uh, with the YMCA and from the very beginning when I walked through the doors, I felt comfortable, I was at home. Beverly would always say, hey, how you doing? And I'd just kind of nod my head to her um, and, and move on. And she kept on, hey, how you doing? And one day she says, I just want you to notice I see a big difference in you, in the way you carry yourself. She said, I was just determined to get you to talk to me. And I told her, I said, well, I would have talked to you, but I couldn't walk up the steps without getting out of breath. And now that I'm able to catch my breath, yeah, we'll talk. It's just been a great friend. He has told his story here at the Y, and uh, more members are encouraged by him. Before his weight loss, he didn't want to go anywhere or do anything. He couldn't. It's just been wonderful, because he's he is a part of my life again, outside of the house. I'm 199 pounds now. And I'm no longer on any medications other than vitamins. Sleep apnea is gone. I have so much more energy and I enjoy life. Hey, <laughs> Just the fact that I get to spend time with my grandchildren uh, makes a huge difference. Lisa and I have a grandchild that has special needs, has uh, some physical limitations and uh, draws disability. And if it were not for the services that the Y provides, the financial assistance, he would just miss so much. And when he misses, we miss. They want to play and they want to have fun and they really enjoy the time. Without financial assistance, it wouldn't be possible. There's no place that they could go for the experience and the benefits that the YMCA delivers. The Y really goes out of their way to make things available for families such as ours. It's a very positive atmosphere and it makes us a closer family. Because of the YMCA, I am able to do anything. I was a slave in my body, and because of the YMCA, I'm free. My name is Rob Havron, and the YMCA gives me more freedom. <laughs>